I always like to say one of my sort of guiding principles in all the years I've been with film preservation, it actually, the first place I saw it was on the wall of the Air Force Museum in Dayton, Ohio, where I grew up. And it's this saying by George Santayana, those who do not remember history are doomed to repeat it. So I've always thought, well, it's important then for us to make this stuff available for people to see so that we learn from our, now whether we actually do learn from it, eh, that's not my problem. But I want to make sure that I do my part so that people have the ability to see this other part of history that is not in the books. I think particularly to the refugee sequences really reinforced this idea of, of history, the circle of history repeating itself is we're, we're looking at these different scenes of the, the refugees and going home at night and watching the news and reading the paper with refugees again. And, you know, you know we're, we were looking at the same scenes we were seeing on the news every night. Mm -hmm. The band is leading the soldiers out to, towards, uh, from Berlin out to uh, the train station to go for the front, go to the front. That's the Brandenburg Gate behind. Durbo's in the back way. there, look in the back, he's kneeling he, with a pipe in his, it's one of the few times you see a pipe, he's, he's loading film in his camera, that's what I think he's doing. And watch the guy there, he just got hit, a sniper, and you'll see some guys heading out as soon as they get their act together, go, trying to go chase him down. Yeah. I think this, I don't think that was staged at all. 